Hello YouTube and welcome to another We Run Radar tutorial. In this tutorial I'll be showing you how to download um, some brushes from one of my previous videos, how to make a Game Battles logo using GIMP 2.6. Um, this video, uh, some questions, how to download all those brushes and stuff. So I figured I'd make a video on it. Now I have all of the uh, things that you'll need up here. I'll put the links to all of these. Here are the smoke brush set, uh, set, and I'll show you how to download them. You just click uh, download, open, allow, and then you'll get this. Now what you want to do is click uh, extract files, browse, go to your um, computer, local disk C, or whatever. The thing with the C after it, it'll have a C. It'll probably be like the name of whatever your computer is. Uh, program files and then go down and find GIMP 2.6 or 2.0 uh, share GIMP and uh, brushes and then click OK and it'll install all those brushes for you. I'm not going to click OK because I already have the brushes. So I'll just cancel out of that. And now for the crown, I couldn't, f I couldn't find. Uh, excuse me, I'm eating pizza. It's really good. So anyway, for the crown, I could not find the original uh, place where I got the crown brushes, but I found this font which has the exact same crowns. So um. You can just download the font instead and use it. Use the font instead of the brush. It doesn't even make a difference. So for this, you just click download, open, allow, and then you'll have uh, this little font thing and share README. Um, on my computer, I have Windows 7, so I don't know if all computers can do this, but on my computer, I can double click it. Uh, this will come up, and I can click install, and it'll do it all for me. And it's easy. It's done. Uh, now I know some computers don't do that, my old computer didn't do that. So what you're going to have to do is right click, copy, and then go into your start menu, go to your control plan, uh, panel, appearance and personalization, fonts, uh, open up the fonts, and this has all your fonts that you um, downloaded, and uh, what you're going to do is just paste it into there, and then it's in your fonts. And then when you open up GIMP, it'll be uh, in your fonts. Same with the brushes. When you open up GIMP after you do put these in, uh, they will all be in there. And then uh, this is the MP5. It has uh, a lot of submachine guns, actually. Same thing with this one. You click download. Uh, continue here. Uh, open. Allow. That'll open up. Read me. Don't really need that. You can just delete it yes and then uh, submachine gun extract files browse computer local disk C program files GIMP 2.0 share GIMP brushes and then have brushes selected and click OK and it'll download uh, that file into your brushes folder and then you'll have um, all those submachine gun brushes. So uh, that's a quick tutorial on how to um, download all of that and um, yeah you'll have them all in there, the smoke ones, the mp5 ones, you know all that stuff. And uh, the crown will be um, under the font uh, Monarch Bats and one of the crowns I like to use a lot from here is if you click the letter G uh, a lowercase G and it makes a really cool crown so that's what I suggest using so uh, yeah this has been another We Run Radar tutorial if you liked it rate comment and subscribe and that's all see ya